my name is Rebecca Reif. I'm really glad that you're joining me. You know, I want to read from you out of Romans um, chapter 8. And I'm going to read from 27 to 29. And the Father, who knows all hearts, knows what the Spirit is saying. For the Spirit pleads for us believers in harmony with God's own will. And we know that God causes everything to work together for the good of those who love God and are called according to His purpose for them. For God knew His people in advance, and He chose them to become like His Son, so that His Son would be the firstborn among many brothers and sisters. Isn't that beautiful? That is, um, in this plan, was from the beginning this was God's plan this whole church it was a plan a, a display God had already determined to do but what I got the most comfort out of knowing is that you know I don't have to beat myself up for all my falling shorts which is for me very easy to do I I know maybe you're like this too and maybe uh, you know you got to punish yourself a little bit when you mess up and got to wallow in it and beat yourself up for a day or two um, you know I now I know I don't have to do that and the more I go through this walk the more I, I receive God's forgiveness the more I realize that I don't I mean I need to be sorrowful for sin yes but I don't need to um, condemn myself you know I can uh, the enemy wants to do that enough. I don't need to help him, you know, because I know from what God's word tells me that he knew me in advance and he chose me to become like his son. So if you're in Christ and Christ lives in you, no matter what mistakes you've made, no matter how many times you've fallen short, no matter, um, if you feel like scum off the bottom of the shoe, which, you know, I've been there. I have absolutely been there. I felt like scum off the bottom of the shoe. I felt so unworthy. And, and I just, after God had told me and told me and told me, I still went down the wrong way. And, and then I start thinking that maybe, um, you know, I'm a mistake. And from, from what God's word says, that is such a lie. That is a lie from the pit of hell because he knew that we were going to be the people that we are and he knew we were going to fall short and he still chose us he chose us anyway and so we can rest in God and know that you know we're not scum off the bottom of a shoe he absolutely knew we were going to behave like that before he even dealt with us and he chose us anyway we are chosen we are a chosen priesthood a chosen generation God has chose us to be in him and we are right where we need to be you know and our job is to work with the Lord to be in cooperation with him to listen to him to obey him and to work on our character defects with him and rely on his strength you know he is the strength living inside of us we cannot do it on our own strength but we can rely on him we can rely on his strength to move forward and so that just gives me such hope that you know God chose me and he chose you and he knew what he was getting and he did it in advance and he can take all of our shortcomings every one of our mistakes and he can turn it around and he can work it for good because we love God and we're called according to his purpose and so it makes me so comforted and so with that I hope you got comfort too I hope you really got something out of that word and I'll see you again next time alright love you bye